News 4 at 4 starts now. Well, the soccer stadium at the fairgrounds gets the green light. Tonight, a big new development. Mayor John Cooper and Nashville SC have reached an agreement. The mayor's office saying he is ready for construction to begin. News 4's Nancy Amons explains what's in the deal. This is a deal for everybody. Mayor John Cooper ready now to go forward with a deal to begin construction of a major league soccer stadium. The team pays the cost of getting the site ready, about 19 million. And the team assumes the risk if ticket sales don't cover costs. Grateful to John Ingram and soccer for kicking in another $54 million that the taxpayers would have had to cover. And then the new announcement about Parcel 8C. Instead of having mixed-use buildings, it will remain as open civic space. Important because it's next to the racetrack, which Cooper hopes will be renovated and usable for NASCAR events. We do have to figure out the funding. Tuesday, Cooper met with Governor Bill Lee asking if the state could help pay for the racetrack upgrade. Governor Lee today. We did not commit to that request. Council members who have been anxious to see the soccer stadium go forward now relieved the city will live up to its commitment. We've been saying we just need to move forward with it, so this is a good outcome. Not a good outcome for the group Save Our Fairgrounds. Its attorney, Jim Roberts, says he's disappointed and says Nashville stands to lose a treasure. Says he's not dropping the suit and may file an injunction. I appreciate everybody in Nashville hanging in there to get the very best deal that we could get done. Nancy Amons reporting. Nancy, what about that community benefits agreement? Does giving up that parcel affect that? Well, Mayor Cooper says it doesn't. Remember, the community benefits agreement involved affordable housing, good wages for workers, and a daycare. Mayor Cooper said that is all still in there. Now, the MLS commissioner is here in town. He's at an event, a fan event that starts at 6. We're going to have team coverage starting at 6 and also at 10. Tracy. Nancy Amons, thanks so much. And as you would imagine, the owner of the soccer club is equally as pleased today. John Ingram sent a brief statement saying, quote, the investment we're making is not just for our soccer team, it's an investment in the future of Nashville and the fairgrounds.